Squad fam, it's Lisa. Oh, the GPS. Oh, well, it's awkward. Hey guys, it's Lisa here. We are on a squad adventure. I'm here with Alex. He's one of our camera ops. We are about to go to the Six Invitational. That's the biggest tournament in Rainbow Six Esports. This is actually my third year covering it and it actually gets bigger every year. So we're excited to go check it out. So apparently Place Bell is very uh, big and we kind of went through a weird entrance. So now we're just looking for where the Rainbow Six Tournament is, but I think we're almost there. I think I see people. And he's up? Yes. Thank you so much. Yay! So this is where the press are uh, situated. It's really nice. It's basically a restaurant in the venue. So there are tables for you know everyone to set up, and then you can watch the games on this giant monitor. And now let me show you guys. The catering here is really good. Looks like it's tacos today. Jordan, say hi to everyone. This is our camera up. He is from here, so his French is amazing. It's impeccable. Do you want to teach everyone a French word? Hello, ça va bien. He just called you guys stupid. So behind the scenes, we got two cameras here. They are checking to match lighting. Like tungsten. All right, so this is going to be our first reactions to the events. More than just the esports side of the Six Invitational, they do a lot of exhibitions, they do a lot of fan art, there's always cosplay here. Already it looks really cool. So it kind of shows that this is more than just a celebration of the esports scene, it really is a celebration of the community. Reppin' Squad, look at our cool banner. We're doing some soundtrack, we're getting the cameras ready, we're gonna do a little walk and talk. Really excited to show you guys what is going on here. There's already a lot of things to see. Whoa! There's a whole calculator on the side of this. You can do your math homework while gaming. Look how amazing these guys are. Um, shout out to the cosplay community in Rainbow Six. Do you guys want to say anything? <laughs> I just posed. Yeah! I love seeing the cosplay here, honestly. I'm always so impressed. All right, guys, I'm in line because I'm a huge fan of reciprocity, you know? Especially Laxing and Fox A. Basically, I'm here to troll. We're about to do a little bit with them. We're gonna go say hi, we're gonna ask for autograph. I wanna fangirl super hard and see how they react. <laughs> Damn it! Oh my god! Foxy, I am your biggest fan. I am so honored to meet you right now. All right, so we successfully surprised the Reciprocity Boys and we got an interview with the coach of MIBR. I believe the first winner's semis finished and now it's pretty busy in the press room because everyone's getting ready for interviews. So we just finished an interview we just finished an interview. Oh, they're gonna do it again. So we just finished an interview with a player from BDS. Uh, it was a Brian. We're, we're on first name basis now. Uh, you guys make sure to watch the whole piece when it comes out. But honestly, everyone I've talked to you are so nice. Are you framing the quarters? Yeah. That's actually him right there. That's some guy that I interviewed. <laughs> Speaking of Brian, he's cheating on me with another media, you know, outlet. Whatever, it's fine. We're not excused. All right, this is us trying press catering. Oh, I should show you what I got, what I got on my plate. Alrighty, so we got some cheese, some crackers with some mysterious stuff on top, pineapple and salmon, and some more salmon, and this mysterious soup. So Alex, what did you say this was? Is there alcohol in this? I'm gonna eat the other stuff. Oh my god, I just saw a huge personality. I am so freaking nervous. Okay, I'm gonna go and say hi, play it cool. 
Oh my god, is that the famous Parker? I was like, what? I didn't want to interrupt you guys. Say hi to the squad vlog. I forgot that was the camera. Hello. It's my toothbrush. One, two, three. Bam, vlog style. <laughs> so you, yeah, uh, oh, check out that mountain. One, two, three. Flips right around. Brush. Fucking incredible. Okay. okay. I want to call you out. So Parker was like, I'll do an interview with you after I get food. He goes and gets food. Two seconds later, I see him with the, just the beer in hand, just drinking away. No, because the food wasn't open yet. No, I don't, it was they, there. I went up there and they said that I had to wait 15 minutes, so I got a beer. Was it just one beer? Was it just one beer? Not really. You're not really. I'm actually he's done. He's done. Parker, what are you doing? <laughs> Look at how that turned out. This is gorgeous. You guys have got to watch it full when it comes out. <laughs> Get things moving once again. Kitchen service is time for SSG, so we're going to continue to move the goalposts. The TSM round. This is And that's a wrap on our first day at the Six Invitational. It's been really hype. We got a lot of good interviews in, and we spoke to some friendly faces, but also met some new ones as well. So I'm really excited to come back tomorrow because it's the grand final. So we're finally gonna see who walks away as the Six Invitational champion. All right, so it's our second day here. It's our day two, but it's the last day of the Six Invitational. But you can't tell it's this is another day, right? I'm literally wearing the same outfit, did the same makeup for continuity for the piece we're about to do. Ah, TV magic. All right, we made it to the venue. We're back here in the press room. Settled in. Jordan's here in his bright yellow sweater. Repping squad, that's what it is. All right, we have some time before the next interview, so we're gonna do a walk around, grab some more B-roll, see if there's any cool spots to shoot from, and you know, just see who we bump into. You never know. However, just makes the attack that much more secure. This entire set of her TSM right now is all on her shoulders. He needs to hold. Psycho's forward position that works out well, but now he's got to capitalize upon it, finding the other point. I just remember that I wanted to check out the merch, but. I don't know if it's still open. They sold out, so there's nothing left. Okay, so we have an interview with Fanatic member Lusty in about an hour. Um, so I'm gonna do some research, think of some questions. All right, so NIP just won and they're going on to the grand finals against Space Station. Right now we have, I don't know if you pronounce it, Julio or Julio. I'm gonna assume Julio, but that might just be an assumption. He's there doing interviews and we're gonna try to get one with him. We're also waiting for a bunch of Fanatic guys to come here and do interviews with us. So it's like, you know, sometimes we're just sitting there waiting for everyone and all of a sudden they come all at once. We just did a bunch of interviews all at once. Was it Julio from NIP? And then the Fanatic boys came at almost the exact same time. And so we did both an interview with Lusty and then Magnet, mic check, one, two, three. Mic check, one, two, just shove the mic in my face. At this point, I think we just have like one or two more interviews and then wait for finals. Because it's about to happen. NA versus Latin America. Space Station Gaming versus NIP. It comes down to this. Now opening ceremony. Check out this opening ceremony.
So the finals are happening right now, but a lot of the vendors are already closing up shop. <gasps> I knew this was gonna happen. So I waited to the very end to try out the setup, but you know, they're disassembling it. That's an unfortunate picture for him. All right, so we're going to film a closing now for the piece that we are making. But since the finals, ooh, since the finals are still happening, we don't know who's going to win. So we're going to shoot two versions because that's also movie magic, you know? Is it going to be brief? That's what we have to ask ourselves. We watched Nick Suminer the setup for their very last defense in regulation. NIP are stomping in the grand final. So basically so now this is when we jump into action. We are leaving the press room that we have been using for a while now. And we're going to another press room where the winners will be taken to. But here, guys, like we we got absolutely slammed on the first two maps. These guys put out their minds over on NIP. Alright guys, that's a wrap. Just finished the post-game interview. Just giving you a quick look right now of the press room. Look how insane it is. I mean, they basically just put up a bunch of tables like in the basement, but <laughs> still works. And yeah, look at that. It's basically a scrum. It's so crazy. Uh, but you guys, thank you for watching the vlog. Thank you for watching the squad venture and joining us on the squad venture. Um, be sure to watch all the actual like content we put out of Rainbow Six. Follow us on all the social medias. You know it. Squad State. This is Lisa and the squad. Alright, everyone's packing up. They're just working. I'm just doing this. Goodbye. Okay, Until next time.